we're at Glencoe Lochan and this little bit of um, exposed rock here, although it's a very small exposure, tells us lo a lot about the regional geology, in fact the, the geology across the whole of Scotland. So we're looking pretty much end on to the folds. The folds are like this, coming in here, and the axes are coming out like this. And the direction the axes are coming out towards you is the southwest. So they're an oriented northeast southwest the folds. So that's the same orientation as the Moyne thrust, northeast southwest. You have compression like this, and so you get folding and crumpling that way, and the axes all run parallel to the Moyne. So this happened during uh, the Caledonian orogeny, and the Moyne was part of the Caledonian when you had this southeast northwest compression direction. And these folds all align consistent with that. The other thing that you can see is that they're quite asymmetric, with long limbs on this side and short limbs on this side. That means that there's a shear, and the shear is pushing uh, your right hand side upwards and your left hand side down. So there's a shear like that. And you can see the sense of shear in the way that the beds on average have been rotated over. If you've got shear like that, then you've got compression in this direction, you've got extension in this direction, and the limbs which are parallel to the direction of extension are much narrower, and the limbs which are parallel to the direction of compression are much wider. You can see it really clearly here, very narrow, wide, narrow, wide, narrow. So that's all telling us about the regional senses of compression and extension, entirely consistent with what's happening during the Caledonia. The other thing that it says, these are quite um, rounded and swirly looking folds. And that means it's uh, a ductile deformation. So this was happening in the mid to lower crust, probably at 20 kilometers depth or more. So you can tell a lot from a very small bit of exposure. Go to oneminutegeology.net for more videos near you and for information about guided geological days out.